You're right guys, it's Capcom Tom here and welcome to episode number 102 of Mission Manchester. Now we're going to jump straight into our trade pile. We have pretty much sold everything but Eto. We got rid of Ronaldinho, Schurler, Negredo, Santi Cazorla and Arabas. So if you're looking for my ultimate team coins and you're not much of a trader, go and check out that link down in the description. Now, we're in the situation where we have 319,000 coins. We've just bought in Form Rooney and we still have Eto, which is going to take us over the 400k mark. So we've got a lot of coins at the moment and we still need to buy Team of the Season Van Persie. Now, our original idea was to move all the coins from trading to a million over to this account and buy Robin Van Persie. Now, Robin Van Persie's actually dropped in price from about a million to about, I believe it's uh, 600 to 700,000 coins. Don't quote me if I'm wrong, but that's around what he's hovering, which means he's not completely out of sight for us to buy just if we trade our way to it. It will prolong this series and it will make it more enjoyable, I think, if we do it all legitimate uh, rather than move, moving coins coins over from trading to a million so I'm asking you guys now if you want me to move all my coins over from trading to a million so we can finish the series sooner or if you want to do this legit and finish it off I'm thinking that I want to do it legit we're not far off the trading's not going to take me all that long it'll probably take me about 10 10 12 episodes to do all the trading to get us to the point where we can buy Robin Van Persie so go put down in the comment section what you think we should do with that situation whether we should buy it with the coins from uh, trading to a million or we should trade there ourselves I'm thinking that a lot of you will go for trading there ourselves to make the series a little bit longer so first game pretty easy one end up winning it 4-1 means we are safe from relegation from division 2 we are floating around in division 2 at the moment after uh, some unfortunate happenings a couple of episodes back where we actually got relegated because EA disconnect or I think someone disconnected from the game and we ended up getting a loss so now that we have bought the inform Rooney we're going to sell our original Rooney making a massive loft loss of about 40,000 coins on him which is an absolute nightmare but to compensate we are going to go and buy David Moyes for our team as so many of you have been suggesting to replace Alex Ferguson obviously Fergie has done us proud over the many many games that he's been in manager of this club I think that he's probably in over 300 games for us which is absolutely incredible and uh, thanks Fergie you've done well it's time to step back and you know go back into the dressing room we're not going to sell him as he is going to be still floating around Manchester United and um you know, con contributing to the team. So we'll leave him in the club, and Moyes is going to take charge in that managerial spot. We bought him for 250 coins, um, which isn't too much of a hefty price tag, which maybe makes me a little bit worried. Anyway, we're going into our next game. It's against a 3 5 2 Bundesliga team, and it looks disgusting. It's got Lewandowski, it's got Royce, it's got Muller, it's got all of the usuals, it's got Schurler. So we're in a lot of trouble, and he does take the lead early on. See there in the 11th minute, an over the top ball to Royce, who ends up scoring. And this is probably the most ridiculous goal from Felipe Santana I have ever seen in my entire life. That is what is wrong with this game. Felipe Santana, not only is he one of the strongest, in fact probably the strongest and cheapest, most overpowered defender, he also has the ability to score bicycle kicks from corners. How ridiculous is that? We end up losing the game 2-1, Nani had a uh, goal in the second half but it wasn't quite enough to push me through and get any sort of result out of it. So we're still stuck on that 10 points, we have 10 or 5 games remaining to get 7 points if we want to win the title and get that 10,000 coin bonus which will be a hefty amount of coins to just pick up from winning the title. Anyway, we've gone and done some trading, we bought this donk for 100,000, trying to list him up for 118,000 coins. Would have done more trading. However, I saw this Hulk, and it's a funny story because I saw him go through the first time. He's got 41 minutes on the clock. That's because he's been realisted for 100,000 start price. I saw him expire with no bids on him for 125,000 coins. I would have been able to make about 50,000 coins before tax if I had sold him on because you sell him on for about 175,000. I was literally seconds from pressing the bid button I was li I literally pressed it on the last second so that no one else would bid and it expired I was like what I think my internet must have lagged and I ended up missing out on a massive deal so we are watching that Hulk and you'll have to see what happens with him in the next episode as I have it became a little bit of an obsession for me to win that Hulk because I was like he's expired for 125,000 last time maybe this time he'll expire for a little bit less or you know whatever we'll have to see what happens but 
We're in our next game and we are currently sitting at a one-all scoreline after Kabul managed to equalise with that header. However, we went back into the lead, Robin Van Persie getting a nice goal with his left foot and then a pretty much carbon copy again of that second goal as Robin Van Persie went through again and managed to score in the 62nd. We're scoring for fun at the moment. We scored two goals in two minutes and do we manage to get a third one? I haven't even edited this bit out. See there, Carrick managing to take the ball and what the fuck was that unbelievable Carrick with the probably the best goal that he's ever going to score for the club one of the longest goals we've scored in Mission Manchester and what a way to win that game 4-1 well done Michael Carrick I absolutely hearted that freaking goal it was unreal so guys that is the end of the episode we do take three points down from this game which is pretty good going I hope you have enjoyed it obviously leave down in the comment section what you want to do around the team of the season Robin Van Persie situation but other than that I'm going to have to leave it there and I will see you all next time.